back. Make some noise. Show some love here. Next comedian, Dennis Cruz. <laughs> I don't know. How are you doing? It's a great night for comedy, huh? Yeah. You know, as a comic, you know, words are bread and butter, right? They're how we make people laugh. Um, <laughs> so we have to know what words mean, not only their definitions, but how they play in society, right? I mean, like, for example, I think pray is spelled that way on purpose. You know, because you have pray, right? And then you have, I don't know, pray, right? <laughs> and so the priests and the pastors could say, oh, we got confused when you told us to pray on the children. That's, <laughs> I don't, but that's coming from a guy who thought insurrection a couple of years ago was something, you know, old guys like me took a little blue pill to solve. I don't know. But words are fun. We have fun with words. We have fun with, but you know, when we put words together, we have fun with, they're called phrases. I love phrases. Anybody else love, I love, I, but there is one phrase that I just don't agree with, and that's eating pussy. I mean, you guys aren't using teeth now, are you? There are no utensils involved, are there? I mean, I get, you know, a little nibble nibble on the side, maybe, but there's no chomp chomp Big Mac attack. Is, I don't, am I missing something? I don't know, I think it should be called licking clip. You know, because that's what you're doing, right? I mean, I, I mean, you can tell by the haircut. I was in the military. I was trained as a pathfinder. Yeah, so I'm able to locate tiny objects in heavy bush. I, you know, it, you know, everybody's familiar with the spank, the, the, the spank bank. Everybody knows this, this guy's building one right now. But you're familiar. Do women have like a slap pack of flicks, picks? Is it just a rub club? Am I just reaching for words now? I don't know. It, 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 it's fun to me. But words are fun. Words, but I'll tell you, the funnest words we have are curse words. Right? I'm going to prove it to you. If, if you know what I'm saying, applaud. After, when I say this next thing, uh, if you get it, hey, buddy, F you in the A. Yeah, I don't even have to say the fucking words. We know what they are. They're so popular. We made up a whole set of words so we could say them around children. Hey, Johnny, don't fuck. I mean, fuck shit, boys. See what you... I'm just reliving something that happened to me. My grandfather thought my name was Johnny for the first 10 years. Hey! <laughs> oh, curse words are... I, I, I just... I will say I have never understood why the term cocksucker is a bad word. Right? I mean, isn't it every guy's wet dream on his birthday or a holiday? You know, princess at the party, not goblin in the car. Oh, I feel you pulling back. I feel you stepping away. Don't leave me out. Come on back aboard the Peter Parker train. We'll get this figured out. <laughs> I, I mean, I get it. When I was when I was young, when I was in my youth, you know, you you were walking down the street, and someone like that guy. That guy's a hell of a cocksucker. You knew there was some anger, some animosity. I don't want to know this person, right? But in today's gender fluid, non-binary society, you might hear something like, that guy, that guy's a hell of a guy. <laughs> I don't know if that's an insult or a compliment. I may definitely want to probably get to know this person a lot better. That's, <laughs> I don't know. I, you know, and I'm just saying with milk and Tinder and Teen Mom, Motherfucker is not an insult. It's an achievement. <laughs> Next time somebody goes, hey, I fucked your mom, you can say, thanks for taking one for the team, man. I'm Dennis Cruz. Thank you very much. This is an